cool. Thank you. You know, I think I know what I can do. I'm gonna be a builder. I mean, look at this. I'm a natural. Uh, did you follow the plan? No need. Look. Jay, this plan says that it's supposed to be a helicopter. Uh, yeah, voila. And I'm Jay. Welcome to Press Play. Today I thought we could put my natural born building skills to the test. Oh yeah, that sounds fun. Here's what we'll do. You all yell out what you want Jay to try and build and he'll try to build it. You ready? Go! Oh, I think I heard skyscraper. Okay, let me look up a plan for building a skyscraper and... No need, my friends. Ooh, ooh. <sighs> Voila. Uh, Jay, that looks great, but it's a dinosaur again, just like the helicopter. What? No way. Look, here are the windows, the door. <laughs> uh, maybe you should just follow the plan. Let's try again. Yell out what you want Jay to build. Oh, I think I heard a tree house. Let me search for a plan really quick. No worries about that. And poof, tree house. Jay, that is a really great dinosaur what? again. <laughs> this is clearly a tree house. Look, here's the branches and this is where the door is, no? I think that if you wanna be able to make these other things, maybe you should just follow the plan. But great builders need no plans. I don't think that's true. Oh yeah? Well, let's say we find out. I'm game, let's do it. Three, Three two, two, one, press play! play. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome! We're on a real work site for a real skyscraper. Jay! Jay, what's wrong? Don't look down, don't look down. <laughs> hey! Ah! Where'd you guys come from? Well, however you got here, it's good to have you. I'm Bobby Build. Oh, cool. Do you build things? Yeah, yeah. I'm Bobby and building is my fave thing. <laughs> nice to meet you, Bobby. I'm Emma and this guy clinging to the beam is Jay. He says he's a natural born builder, but doesn't think that he has to follow the directions to be a builder. Okay, who needs a plan when you can just build? Oh. If I didn't follow a plan, there is no way I'd be standing on this beam right now. Uh, uh, wh what, is, wh what does that mean? It means she follows the plan. Yes. Hey, you know the Bible talks about that in Mark chapter 1. Jesus was going around telling everyone the good news. The good news was the plan for him to rescue the whole world from sin and death. It was a plan that couldn't fail because it was God's plan. Jay, are you hearing this? Hearing every word. Not looking down and hearing every word. But this plan included Jesus finding others to share the good news alongside him. So Jesus found a couple fishermen. One day, Jesus was walking beside the Sea of Galilee where Simon and Andrew were fishing. In Mark 1, 17 through 18, it says, <clears throat> Come, follow me, Jesus said, and I will send you out to fish for people. At once, they left their nets and followed him. F fish for people? Yeah, how do you fish for people? <laughs> Simon, Andrew, James, and John were fishermen. They caught fish. That was the plan for their life. They thought, but Jesus had a new plan. They wouldn't be catching fish anymore. Instead, they'd be fishing for people by getting the people hooked on the good news of Jesus. You guys get it? Hooked? Like a fish hook, you guys get it? Yeah, I get it. Yeah. And I'm too frightened to endure bad jokes. <laughs> but this was the new plan for Simon and Andrew. It meant leaving behind all they had ever known and were comfortable with. I mean, they've been fishing their whole lives. They're probably pretty good at it. And comfortable at sea, like I am up here. Watch. Oh, Whoa! Oh, 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 please. <laughs> no, 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 It's no, no. no problem. Whoa. They knew following Jesus was the right plan for them. It's just like I look at a blueprint for a building, right? 
I don't always know the obstacles that will come as I build, but I do know that if I follow the blueprint, then the building will be strong. So just like I can trust a blueprint, I can trust God's plan for me. <laughs> oh, ho, 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 looks like we gotta go. Let's go. Thanks a lot, thanks a lot, but we gotta go, we gotta go. <laughs> Thanks, Bobby Bill. This was so cool. I don't know if the plan for Jay is being a builder after all. Well, you both trust God's plan for your life. It'll turn out great. I think you're gonna have to do the secret handshake with me because Jay's uh, glued to that beam. I'd love to. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> looking at the plans, huh? Oh, never not looking at the plans again. I think you can do great things when you follow a plan. There's no limit to what we can do when we trust God's plan for us. We pressed play and ended up on a steel beam of a skyscraper being built. We met Bobby Build. She taught us about following plans and Mark chapter one, where Jesus tells Simon and Andrew the new plan he has for them. It must've been hard to leave what they knew, but they chose to do what we can choose to do. I can trust in God's plan for me. You know what time it is? Time to drop, drop the, the verse. verse. What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Get your Bibles out. I can do all this through Him who gives me strength. Philippians 4 13. Philippians 4 13. Uh huh. I can do all this through Him who gives me strength. Philippians 4 13. Oh, 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 oh. I can do all this. Through him who gives me strength, Philippians 4, 13, Philippians 4, 13. It's time for today's Bible story. It comes from the book of Mark, chapter 1. Jesus was going to a town called Galilee. And walking along the Sea of Galilee, Jesus saw a person named Simon and his brother Andrew out fishing. Simon and Andrew were fishermen. That means that catching and selling fish was how they made money. But Jesus called out to them and said, come, follow me. I'll send you out to fish for people. Fish for people? That didn't make sense. Jesus meant that they would tell people all about how they can get to know God and believe that Jesus was the savior. Simon and Andrew heard Jesus loud and clear, and you know what? They left their fishing nets right away and followed Jesus. As Jesus continued walking by the sea, he saw James and his brother John. They were also fishermen. They were with their dad and some other worker when Jesus called out to them, just like how he did to Simon and Andrew. James and John left their boats and decided to follow Jesus too. Jesus chose Simon, Andrew, James, and John to be part of his close group of friends called the disciples. They left everything in order to be with Jesus and to learn from him. They had no idea what was going to happen next, but the reason they dropped their nets and followed Jesus was because they believed, I can trust God's plans for me. <laughs>